to our phones. Marjorie is calling from Ohio who ordered the CD and she love, love, loves you, Mariah. Welcome. You're live on the air, Marjorie. Hi, Marjorie. Hi. Oh, my God. I'm so excited you said my name. <laughs> Isn't it exciting? Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I'm your biggest fan. I'm a lamb and I'm also a card carrying member of Honey Bee Fly. So oh. just so you know, I'm the real, I'm the legit fan here. Exactly. That's how I know. So thank <laughs> <Yeah>. you. <laughs> and, uh, and I'm 40 too. So just know all your fans aren't young that do that. So <laughs> I, we're the same age. But um, I just wanted to tell you that I wear your fragrance. And I um, actually get asked all the time, you know, ooh, what are you wearing? And, and I just, I go, Mariah. And I just like, <laughs> it smells that good. And, um, yeah, it's, real, it's, it's a fragrance that people just always constantly ask me, oh, my gosh, what is that? And you know what? Ironically, I don't like musk, and I'm not really a big fan of Lily of the Valley, but this is just great. I don't, I just. It's a great <laughs> fragrance. This is my favorite one of all of yours, and I have them all. Oh, well, that's good. good. So, but this one is like a new version of the Luscious Pink, which is funny because, I mean, I, I love the original, but then this has like another sort of, I don't know if it's a staying power. What do you think? It does. It, it definitely stays. There's a little bit difference because you don't have the constant, or you have more concentration of the pure parfum. <laughs> I just sprayed it in my eye. I did that yesterday. <laughs> oh. I was spraying, and I did the same exact thing, but this is more concentrated. You don't have the alcohols that you normally find that evaporate quickly in most of the eau de, uh, the colognes or the eau de toilette. So what's nice about this is it really stays with you. One squirt and you're good. Oh. I can't wait to get it. Um, <laughs> Mariah Carey, your hair looks absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> Did you follow her on Twitter Thank about you. the hair? <laughs> I have my whole wish list set up. I have the jewelry, every single thing on my um, oh. HSN shopping network, uh, you know, the thing. I have all your jewelry picked out, the boots, and of course the shoes. Yay. Are you going to wear those dress. shoes? Are you going to wear the, the double platform very, oh, very I'm extra gonna, super fast? I'm going to wear them while I'm holding my husband's arm because I can't really wear heels right now. But yes, and I like those. I love the boots with the open toe. Yeah, oh, I love killer. the open toe boots. I'm wearing them right now. Those but are killer. Very cute. Very yeah, cute. And then the, I got the album. I actually got it early. Oh, you did? I so did you order from HSN? HSN? Yes. Yay. And did you, and so you got I, the DVD? I was excited. What, what's that? Did you get the, so you saw the DVD then? I got the DVD and of course I watched it. Yes, <laughs> I loved every moment of it. It was so exciting to see you in your natural form just in the, in the studio with, um, you know, of course, Randy Jackson. Yes, we love me. Randy. And, uh, yes. and my mom, you know, we didn't have that much of the footage then, but we debuted the, the video the other day. Um, yesterday, actually, and I don't even know if my mother saw it, but hopefully oh. she's watching. <laughs> that is such a classic to have your mom and you on that duet. It's amazing to me that she has such a wonderful, powerful, and profound, rich voice. It's, yeah. it's great to be able to hear it finally after all these years of admiring you. It's like, oh my God, that's, you know, great. And then the, some of the songs on the album actually is um, the, the Christmas Time is in the Air. I can't believe the jazzy edge you put to it. That's so fantastic. Thank it's you. Like, no, we wrote, that's a new song that I wrote for this album with, uh, I know. with was, Mark Shaman. And so uh, it was one of those things I said I wanted to do like a 50s kind of a song that sort of felt like a, a retro kind of like um, when those big classic Christmas songs like Nat King Cole and oh, yes. Bing Crosby and stuff. So Thank you. I'm so glad you brought that up. I listened to that before I got on, uh, came out here today. So I'm, I'm happy that you brought that up. And um, I love, I love talking to you. So thank you for calling. Thank you, Marjorie. Have a wonderful, <laughs> healthy, happy yes. holiday season. And if all of you could pop.